mentioned about the, you know this country. Everyone I spoke to this week saying you were coming on. There's a real, like a real sincere and authentic fondness for mm. you. What, where is that? Is that is that the Celtic thing or is it? Uh... I, I don't know. Everyone in Ireland seems to like. It's been every show we've done in Ireland seems yeah. to be like. Everyone kind of really takes me in and, and, yeah. and, and treats me very nicely. Good. Uh, and I love it here. It's like it's honestly like coming. Like I'd never been to Ireland until like two years ago. That right. was the first time. And ever since, it's kind of felt like coming like a, like a second home, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know, I think it's just like, I, I like singing and I like getting pished. And so does, so does yeah. Irish people. It's a great company. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> pished. Yeah, proper pished. I like that. And, you're, and you like a good yarn, you know what I mean? You like a good... Do you like to tell a story? I like to spin a yarn, spin yeah. Spin a yarn. Do, yeah. all through, um, the coppers thing, by the way, uh, mm -hmm. you did drop it. That is yours. Oh, yeah, this, yeah, is, my, your, this is my... That, that, is that the true story? You, my copper's gold card. Do you hold it close to your heart? I, well, it's usually in my wallet, so it's close to my arsehole. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but that doesn't... That doesn't cha that's no comment on my fondness for coppers. Yes. I, and can I get that? Was that in shot? It's in shot, yeah. Uh, next time I come to coppers, I'm not paying for a single drink. Correct. So, Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. <laughs> fair deal, fair deal. <laughs> no, I just, um, yeah, it was like, I can't remember who told me, like, you have to go to Coppers after the first, the first show we did here uh, in, like, one of the academy sure. venues. And they said, um, yeah, you need to go. And I walked in and it was crowded and there was wrestling on the TV, which I thought was weird, but it, I was going with it. Yep. And then I went to the bar and the first thing that happened, bought my pint, turned around, someone knocked it out of my hand and I thought, I'm home. <laughs>